In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the Find and Replace option to remove double returns in InDesign. So a lot of times when you paste in long articles or anything that's lots of paragraphs in a row, it's often going to come in with two returns between paragraphs. So the problem with this is that the space is hard to control and it often is going to be too much space visually. So to check if you highlight through a paragraph break, if it highlights like this, you've got a paragraph. You can also go to your type menu and choose show hidden characters. And you can see that I've got the symbol for a return twice in a row. So to get rid of those, I'm going to go to edit and then find change. So I need to use this side menu here. And the side menu has tons of these mostly hidden character options. So I'm going to find end of paragraph. And then I'm just going to do the same option twice so that I have two of those in the find. And that will find everywhere where I have two of these returns in a row. And then I'm going to change to just one end of paragraph. And I'll click change all. So I can see 15 replacements were made. You could do that again until you get zero. And now you can see all of these double returns are gone. This is also a great way if you get an article from someone who typed with the sort of outdated style of putting two spaces after every sentence. In the find box, you can just tap your space bar twice and then the change box, do it once, and you just keep hitting change all until you get zero. Now when I go to make my paragraph styles, I can go to indents and spacing, add a space after, and I have a much more reasonable space than a double return. So those are just a couple clever ways to use the find change window to both find and replace all double returns or double spaces that may happen in copy that you have put into InDesign. 